Part 14, more KineMaster. So once you have selected the media that you want to bring in, you can always add more, but once you've done your initial selection of all of your hosting, you will go back to this main editing window in KineMaster and it will put your clips on the timeline. The timeline is this bar shown here on the bottom um, of the KineMaster app. And on the upper left-hand side, you can see the previews. So there is a small um, red playhead. And as you drag the playhead with your finger, you'll see the preview window change uh, because wherever the playhead is, is whatever part of the timeline you are editing. Other important things to note about the KineMaster layout, to the left, uh, there is a backwards swirly arrow. That is an undo button. If you make a mistake, undo it. Um, below that is a little garbage can. That is the trash. We are going to use the trash as we edit out uh, parts of our hosting that we don't want. And when you click or push on the clips in the timeline, You'll know you've selected the clip to edit because it will be highlighted in yellow and this additional menu will pop out from the side. This menu from the side are a bunch of editing options. The main one that I want us to focus on is the second um, icon. It's a pair of scissors and it is the trim split icon. This is what we're going to use to cut out all the parts of our hosting that we don't want anymore.